And welcome to one of the great sports settings in America, Michigan Stadium on a college football Saturday. Here for the big house at East Carolina, visiting number two, Michigan. They've been coming to football games here since 1927, almost 100 years. And once again, over 100,000 have gathered on a beautiful first Saturday in September here in Southeast Michigan. Max Protect, let's take a shot down the field. A good spot on the field to start thinking about that. This is an inside give that will go nowhere. Loss of a yard. NFL prospect. East Carolina empties the backfield. And the big Garcia, here he goes, design run. To the 46 yard line. He'll pick up about three there. It's been broadcast throughout the year. The play leaves us with third and nine. And Garcia retreating. Throws it to Mikey Sanger still with the interception from Michigan. The nickelback converted wide receiver, one of the leaders of this defense, comes up with the game's first turnover. This is one that East Carolina, Mason Garcia, are going to wish they had back, Mike. Definitely. You know, looking at the play, he's got the little slot corner route here. He's got enough time to throw it. He's got somebody bearing down on him, but throws it off the back foot. It just doesn't let it go. Got a lot of room in front of him. Mikey Sainer still makes a nice play. Good hands by him. I like the idea by East Carolina. Chris, look at this. This is a tribute oh, to Jim Harbaugh. Go. As the Michigan players put up four fingers before they broke the huddle here for their play to start from the 43-yard line. That train formation we saw Harbaugh use back in 2016 against Wisconsin. They will swing it out to the 46-yard line as the running back Donovan Edwards gets it. So that was a play put in in tribute to their coach who is suspended for the first three games. They're down now for the Wolverines with their own 46. McCarthy's got five in the pattern. Fires back to Wilson. He's got it for the first down. Roman Wilson at the 38-yard line. Very good. And I think this year you're going to see more ownership of the offense from J.J. This is Coram dancing to the left. Good move, Coram. Into the secondary. Blake Coram to the 15-yard line. A pickup of 23 for the senior out of Marshall, Virginia, who injured his knee late last year. It may have been on his way to a date on Heisman Trophy night if he didn't get hurt last year. I would agree with that. And this is where it starts for Michigan. The, the offense alignment, as we discussed earlier, they got two NFL running backs. And this guy, too, he's a little ball of muscle, breaks tackles, <laughs> breaks ankles, does it all. 21 officially. Michigan looking good in this second drive. McCarthy to the tight end. Loveland got a block. We'll take it to the 10 yard line. Holston Loveland. Two receivers each side. Five in the pattern. McCarthy flush. Steps up. Got a throw on the run. Touchdown. Michigan touchdown. Roman Wilson. If McCarthy stayed on side, it's the first score of the year for the Wolverine. I think they're going to review this. It's very, very, very close. close. Again, I think he's okay, Mike. I, any part of the body back behind the 14-yard line, including the ball. Set of eyes in the replay booth. So a lot of folks are there just to make sure that the big stuff doesn't get missed. And here's Greg Sujak with the determination. After review, the ruling of a touchdown stands. Terry, you surprised? looking at we look at the line feed up James Turner for the extra point his first kick is a Wolverine replacing Jake Moody is good so Michigan gets a little bit of a break on the replay but a nice throw McCarthy on the move thought about running last second saw a better option Roman Wilson the senior in the end zone first touchdown at 20 23 for the maize and blue for Michigan Man, there's one big dude after another up there. They're going to have to be creative. I'd like to see them get on the edge a little bit. From the 37 on the run there, throws it incomplete for Josiah yeah, Hadfield. They don't want to make a big mistake, and I think that's what you're seeing from Mason Garcia right now. Being a little too careful, he just got a little rip. 37 inside, get from Gunn, not going to go anywhere. Again, the Michigan defense with the penetration. The first guy there was Derek Michigan. Moore. You see all these people at the line of scrimmage. Who's coming? Who's dropping? Comes the pressure, Gunn gets away, Garcia gets away, and he gets just past the 40-yard line, so instead of taking the big loss, 
year for us here on NBC and Peacock. 7-0 Michigan, J.J. McCarthy back to the air, across the middle, complete to the 29-yard line, 19 yards for Cornelius Johnson, the graduate student from Greenwich, Connecticut. Red pocket, my Ooh. goodness. Wow. Max Bredesen comes back to block for Donovan Edwards. Edwards will take it that way. He'll gain a, about a yard. Oh, as Second and nine, Edwards is to the left. About three yards there. Happy hit by Julius Wood. Johnson in motion. Third and seven. Pressure comes. It's picked up. McCarthy strokes it complete. Wilson to the 44. And the senior Roman Wilson from Honolulu has a Michigan first down. You see big people in here again. The 44. They'll protect. McCarthy will step up. Go downfield. Crosser. Wilson was contacted. And the flag's down. You just mentioned Julius Wood is good. Coverage might not be his strength. 15 yards because Wilson may still be running. Exactly. If you let him go. Final play of the quarter. Edwards on a bounce and he stopped. Gain of two. At the 39 yard line. And just well, Jim Harbaugh three game suspension along the way. Wolverines start the quarter at the 39. McCarthy under center. Corum's got the edge. Play Corum on the run. Corum might go. Corum to the pylon. And he is. No signal yet. Looks like he's just short. Yep. Out of bounds at the two. Out of the Harry two, Mike. For Corum, that foot out before the extension. Just outside the two, they're trying inside. Power to the goal line. Laying on bodies. Looks like he's in the spot, Will. Wow, Let's I thought see. he got in. I thought he was laying in for there the touchdown. Go. Blake Corum had 18 rushing touchdowns last year. And he brings the first one of 2023 for the Wolverines. The replay will take a peek at that as it has been for about 70 years. It's all about running. It, it's old school. Yeah, it and is. I like it. It's refreshing for the, the day and age we're in right now where everybody wants to be in the shotgun and throw the ball 55 times a game. No, it's still back to the basics here for Michigan. They got the guys up front on both sides of the ball to play that style of football. The last and few minutes, very good last year. One of the least penalized teams in all of college football. Edge run here. Harris, nice run to the edge, the 30-yard line. And a good play. Third second and manageable for East Carolina. And Alex Flynn going to bubble this out. This is technically a run play. It may have been a backward pass. Whatever. Harris is the back. To fake the pitch. Quarterback will keep it and get the first down. There. Out to run through gets the first down. Flynn back to work. Back to the air. Back shoulder throw is he's intercepted. What a play. Picked off by Josh Wallace. He read the back shoulder and took it away from the receiver. Like insane play. Insanity in the membranity. I, first <laughs> off, I couldn't believe a DB adjusted the ball like that, but then got, it looks like Mike two feet down. So even when he caught it, I went, well, he's going to go out of bounds here. Incredible job. We're watching Wallace, the graduate student who played at UMass. Let's see if he gets down inbounds as he goes back to get it. Yes, absolutely. Terrific play. Two feet down. Josh Wallace, first game in the big house. First. season long on NBC and streamed here on Peacock. First run, and it's Edwards to the edge of the 36-yard line. Donovan Edwards with a gain of 11. Donovan Edwards, Edwards carry there while you were looking at that, lost for a yard. So now it's third and 11 from the 35. ECU brings some pressure. 
McCarthy moves, fires complete. That's Carmelo English. No, it's Johnson six. Beg your pardon. Johnson is graduate student from Michigan. Do here. You want to run it? I would think so. Or maybe protect and take a shot. There here go. it is. Donovan Edwards, the fake, the throw across the middle is complete. The tight end, Colston Loveland, to the 25-yard line. Nine yeah. in a row here. Both backs, Corum and Edwards, in the game. They're both out in the pass pattern. McCarthy hit as he throws to Loveland. He's got it at the 10-yard line. Colston Loveland, what about the location on that ball, Chris? Touch of the 10, first and goal for the Wolverines. Back to the air again, McCarthy. Flushed, fires across his body, and then a touchdown! Two for two, scrambling to Roman Wilson. Michigan touchdown. Wow. They put you in such a bind. And then when McCarthy extends plays, he's really good at that. We know you can see he throws it on the run. Receivers, and all of a sudden it becomes, oh no, we got to play pass defense. Very good plan of attack so far by Sharon Moore, who I know is not here, and Kirk Campbell, who's in the booth today calling the plays. Well, they miss Jake Moody now. James Turner with a major shank on that extra point. Moody was the longtime kicker now. Drafted by the 49ers of the NFL. Touchdown number two for Roman Wilson. Wolverines up 25, Michigan. And Flynn will throw. He'll get the first down. Bond, nice shake out of the backfield. And some explosive speed on the run across midfield in the first down. And that is exactly why they want to get him in. It's a fresh pick once again by Michigan. Okay. And now he's got to organize it and figure it out. They run it. And Flynn keeps it. He gets the first down. Good effort by Alex Flynn. Three dive under two minutes. And Flynn with it on the ground. A couple of yards with Javius Bond. Mm -hmm. 15 remaining in this first half. And Flynn protected for the moment. Nothing opens. So now he's running for his life. Trying to get rid of it. Got to get it back to the line of scrimmage. Somewhere in that general vicinity. And he does. As he was gotten out of the tackle box. Jalen Harrell comes in for Michigan as East Carolina sub late. Michigan should have been caught with too many men on the field. It wasn't flag. Flynn fires. Beautiful throw caught at the 15-yard line by Jalen Johnson. Did he hang on? Let's see. Conversation here. I think the ball may have come out late, but they say catch for Johnson at the 15-yard line and out of bounds. The pass is incomplete. The sophomore from Kernersville, North Carolina. This is from 51 to get the Pirates on the board. And it's going to be no good. Missed it to the left. So Conrad, his career long is 47. Colorado, all coming up in a moment. Michigan to the air, and McCarthy throws. It is another completion to Cornelius Johnson. 40 seconds, two timeouts left. Wolverines keep the clock going and Jesse Minter acting as the head coach today in charge of the timeouts in this situation McCarthy's sideline it is ruled a catch rolling out of bounds for Frederick Moore there's the freshman does restart so at 20 McCarthy in the middle complete right around the 40 yard line another first down to stop it or two before the half is done the 41, McCarthy trying to get another first down. He will on the sideline. Catch is made. That's Moore again. They love this freshman out of St. Louis. A man who handles a lot of that in the press box for four years. So he is very keen on managing the clock. He's trying to save that timeout and give Michigan a shot to score again before the break. Little out route you're going to see to get out of bounds. And it's incomplete with McCarthy. Off target. And now, the suburb of Ann Arbor, just a few miles from here in the big house. And we'll see if he can go from 50 before the break. With the pressure on. And into the wind. Turner, low line drive. And he got it from 50. That was good from 60. And a very good way to end an ideal half for Michigan. Seven in the first, 16 points in the second. 
And their quarterback McCarthy on a heater 16 of 18 for a buck 81. To continue to see great efficiency on third down on both sides of the ball. Solid in the red zone. Continued great play by J.J. McCarthy. And then he said expect to see more run plays here in the second half to kind of soften his game up. My Not the typical look, but the second half, I think we're going to see them get back to smash mouth and working on that aspect of their offense. McCarthy on the fake of the toss to Max Bredesen. First down for... The 41, Blake Corum, a bounce to the left, threw a tackle, Corum to the 49-yard line. And we said, okay, we like it, let's go. Wolverines bring in a sixth offensive lineman again, Trent A. Jones, and they'll protect. But McCarthy throws it complete. Across the middle of the 35, Cornelius Johnson again. Attack you with Michigan. Goes down for the 35, Corum cuts it back. He'll gain about two yards, maybe three to the 32. See, coach, I, they just need a little sizzle and splash mm -hmm. every now and then to keep you off of that and create some plays when they play the college football elite. We go quick here, Corum to the inside. Looks like he'll get the first down right at the 25 yard Either line. Either way, good play by the DB. Nice cut up the field for Edwards. Donovan Edwards right at the first down marker with a flag. One of them in the game right now, A.J. Barner, transfer from Indiana on third down. McCarthy looks right, fires for Wilson for the hat trick. He got it. Michigan touchdown, third of the game for Roman Wilson. I mean, again, great eyes. He looks to the flat to make the corner sit flat-footed just a little bit. And so he threatens the, the throw to six and then throws just a perfect, appropriate ball into the back corner. What is that, Mike? The fifth or sixth great corner route we've seen them throw to that? Yeah, hey, great route combinations, right? Great. The flat underneath it. Make just it tough on zone coverage. Put the corner in the bind. Who do you want to stop, the high one or the low one? And McCarthy makes the right decision. J.J. McCarthy has thrown three. All three to Roman Wilson. Lighten it up on opening day in the big half. He does not appear in the rule book. It's just, it just helps the interpretation. It makes the them officials. be more, it helps them to be more accurate in most cases. That's true. Well said. Garcia dropping a roll here for the 25. He's going to try to throw it incomplete. He was running for his life. He was being to avoid the bagel. I would. All right, all right. Just, just getting ahead of it. Maybe look at the first down. Garcia on the run. Nice move there. We get to the 14. Oh. So it's third now and about six and a half. <laughs> and late in the game, you know, you usually go for it. But we kicked the field goal, so Bill Cowher and company couldn't have the shutout. <laughs> just, you know, make him a little angry. <laughs> Garcia is going to move his receiver here. Fourth down. Step it up. Flag is down. And he is down to the 13 yard line. That for, especially for a volleyball game. Harper's sister Kendall, a senior starter here for the Wolverines in volleyball. Gerald Green transferred to Georgia Southern with a catch. Hey, the pressure, everything. Mason Garcia threw one great ball after another in pregame. But oh. as you see, that's just what nerves do in, in, in inexperience. And he lost control of the ball and made some bad decisions. And a good program at Texas San Antonio now fill out the American. Final dozen seconds. Garcia's got time. Underneath and complete. To the 16. Gonna take a timeout. He's gonna take an end zone shot here on the final play with five seconds left. And see if they can get points on the board and avoid the shutout. East Carolina. They're third and five. They're gonna do it, Mike. Oh, they're gonna go for the field goal. Go field goal. I told I knew it. He's a defensive coach. He doesn't want to see that shutout on his watch. I can't believe they're about to do this either. Andrew Conrad, sleeve on the left leg. To get on the board from 33. And he knocks it through. On the final play of the game. No shutout here, Tariko. No, nope. Syracuse remains on the books. The last <laughs> shutout of the Pirates. 30 to 3, the final score. Jesse Minter and the Michigan Wolverines get the victory.
And Jesse's opportunity to be the head coach and a complete performance for Michigan defensively. The yards look a little bit different than they did, but when it mattered, when the starters were in, they were dominant. And a tremendous game from J.J. McCarthy, the quarterback. 26 of 30, only four incompletions, 280 yards and three touchdowns to his outstanding senior wide receiver. Mike will tell me what it's like to get this season opening win. Oh, uh, it's a it's a great win. The players did a great job uh, led by J.J. Our offense, I thought, did a really good job just taking what they gave us. And uh, these guys are the star of the show, so I think you should talk to him. <laughs> okay, there you go. Oh, Coach Harbaugh right <laughs> Exactly. <laughs> All right, J.J., tell us about the confidence you said you worked on in the offseason yes, and how you brought it to the field in this first game and how things developed into this big win. Uh, I mean, it's simple as it's amazing what preparation does for you out there. I just felt so cool, calm, and collected. The offensive line played amazing. It felt like I was playing seven-on-seven -seven football back there. So receivers did their thing. Offensive line did their thing, like I said. Running backs, too. And we got the best defense in the country, so it was, it was nice. Speaking of receivers, you and Wilson connected first, second, and third quarter. What's it like to have that early vibe here in this season? I mean, that vibe was cooking up all offseason. We were working on it almost every single week, multiple times a week, and it's just amazing to showcase it to everyone. Yeah. We shared with everybody uh, in this game that you didn't have just a ship on your shoulder. You said you've got the whole bag on your shoulder. How does this help relieve a little bit of that pressure, or does it remain the same? It remains the same. We're, we're one and oh, but we got to go two and oh. That's the only thing that matters. So this this game is great. We did a lot of good things, a lot of good things to learn from and get better at, but it's on to week two. All right, JJ, thanks a lot. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Mike?